Thank you. Well, one week from this Saturday is the first of two Susan G. Komen races for the cure Saturday and Finley Sunday in downtown Toledo. And it's not too late to get involved. Desmond Strew is here from Komen with Artina McCabe in the Toledo in celebration of honoree. A big deal. <laughs> We're celebrating you. Yes, yes, yes. we should, right? So uh, just in case folks um, missed it last night, uh, Melissa Andrews highlighted uh, Artina in a beautiful story. So it, one of the things that uh, when you first got diagnosed, you were not incredibly positive. Oh, no. Right. Definitely not. I was actually petrified. Mm -hmm. And because I didn't know anyone and didn't have anyone, any support or sure. anything, I considered it a death threat. So I just, I just knew I was going to die. No. Yes. No. Yes. <laughs> so when was that diagnosis? Um, it was September 16th, 2016. Okay. So a few years ago, almost to the day, right? Yes. <laughs> and uh, here you are. Yes. Alive and thriving, <laughs> right? So what made you kind of change your attitude and turn things around? Um, actually support systems. I started meeting people. My daughter introduced me like to Susan G. Coleman and they directed me into different support groups. Um, my church family, uh, just reading the Bible, having scriptures uh, around my room completely. I had them plastered my walls <laughs> and everything. And it was a slow process, yeah. but I definitely came through it and everything. And um, Excited and grateful now, mm -hmm. yes. And a rocker, we see you playing the drums. <laughs> That's fun. <laughs> yes. So you're, you keep at it, right? Having a good time? Oh, yes, yeah. definitely. So what, you know, with Susan G. Komen, as you said, I kind of hooked you up with some support groups and, you know, help you get connected to people. Um, what other services uh, have you been helped by with Susan G. Komen? Um, well, I have the um, lymphedema sleeve, mm -hmm. and they also um, helped me as far as when I was going through all yeah, my and yeah. radiation and everything, and my husband got laid off. Mm. They helped Great with, timing, yes, yeah. definitely. Yeah. They helped with um, food mm -hmm. and um, helped with some of my copays because I was wow. going to the doctors quite a bit. Sure, so. sure. So, I, I mean, you mentioned something like food. Uh, that's not one of the things that we necessarily think, Desmond, when mm -hmm. we're thinking of Susan G. Komen. And we know that when we pay these race registrations that our, our money is going to support, you know, patients. But, I mean, it's the simple things in life, right? right? It's, you know, that's, it's so true that, you know, we, we think of the, the obvious things like a mammogram or paying for cancer treatment. But right. so many people just need the things, the, ba the most basic yeah. things to make sure you can get to your appointment, make sure that you're staying, staying healthy while you're going through treatment. And mm -hmm. so that's, it's so important to be considering those things. And we are so grateful to the whole community and to wonderful survivors yes. like Tina for being, being so, such a big support for this cause and coming down to the race, paying those registration fees, as you mentioned, and making a big difference. Yeah, so we're going to make it as easy as possible for you to get registered. You're going to be at the mall this yes. weekend, right? We are going to be <laughs> at Franklin Park Mall on Saturday and Sunday uh, from 10 to 4 and 11 to 4. And you, you can pick up your packet, you can register, you can get uh, yard signs, posters, whatever you want to need. Mm -hmm. We're going to have it there. And if you miss that, we're also going to be at Brondi's Ford and Mommy mm -hmm. on Thursday, Friday, and Saturday, right before the race. Right before the race. So, cool. so many opportunities. And you can get online right now and register if you want to, mm -hmm. right? Yeah. So, Artina, how much more pink do you have in your wardrobe? <laughs> <laughs> That's my new favorite color right? now. Right, right? Yes. Uh, and it looks beautiful on you. <laughs> Thank you look you. fabulous. So, uh, again, just make plans for the Races for the Cure in either Finley uh, or uh, Toledo next Saturday or Sunday. But this Friday, we want everybody to wear pink, <laughs> just like Artina has on this morning, so that um, we can help support uh, wonderful women like her and others who are, you know, battling and mm -hmm. fighting and we're all racing for the cure. So uh, please be involved in that and get out to the mall this weekend if you need help with registration or you want to pick up your packet, you're ready. Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're ready to go. Exactly. All right. Thanks so much for coming <laughs> Thank today. Thank you. We appreciate it.